Welcome to another lesson. Uh, today we're just going to be focusing more on the beginner level, right? We're using Lord I Live to Your Name One High as kind of a very uh, famous and a common song that most of us might know. So we're in F major. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. of us know the major scale mm. okay so we are going to look at it from a very basic perspective then after that we'll try and see if probably we can change some things there like normally as beginners we will play like this you came from heaven to earth just doing that section of this song we want to start from the beginning because because of time we don't have too much time you came from heaven to earth to show the way. Uh, just on F major chord, this, this on my left hand, and this on my right hand, C, F, A on my right hand. You came from heaven to earth. Great, so to a B flat major, B flat, B flat, D. Show us something different. See if maybe we can try and use some other concepts to just play as beginners. We're not playing too much complicated stuff. Just beginner stuff, right? You came from heaven to earth. We normally go like this, right? Let's change it and play this. Great. The idea is it's still coming from the C7 chord, but this time we are playing the E on the left to give us a 7 instead of the 5. So. E, B flat, left hand, C, E, G, right hand. Okay. Instead of us to go to the major, we're going to the C. Alright, then we get F major 7. Like, oh, okay, that sounds a little bit different. Right, so this is a major chord, F major, then we add in the 7 to give us F major 7. You came from heaven to earth to show the way. So you see, it has changed it a bit for us. From the earth, 
instead of us to go to the cross, we are like, no, let's go to the cross. To the cross, my dad. Alright, let's change that chord there. Like, we normally play the C major. Let's do it. Like, oh, but you said we are going to be in beginner's mode, right? Yeah, we're still in beginner's mode. We just playing a normal C7 and we are adding the sharp 11 not too much of a fancy chord there great and we are voicing it this way great on the right hand and this on the left hand G flat C then B flat E G very nice the idea is that we a tritone substitution so this is basically our five right we're like okay let's find the tritone for five a tritone uh, basically is like three tones away from that note you're playing we will not go too much into theory because most of us here just want to play the stuff all right so let's see how we get a tritone so semitone so this is one tone, same tone, tone, two tones, same tone, tone, three tones. We get a tritone. Some people uh, would find very fast ways of having their tritone like this, like sharp four. They'll be like, okay, in top of the four, and play sharp four, and you get a tritone. Some will be like, ah, play a flat five. This theoretically is is giving us a diminished fifth but it still has this tritone sound we're just concerned about the sound so let's just keep it like that another way is um, probably if like you have your diminished chord if you can play a diminished chord you see that you're having a tritone in there how do we find out we just remove the second note and we get a tritone very smart move right so let's go on keep this here very nice so you came from everywhere to show the way from the earth to the cross my dad to pay ah, like oh okay very nice from the cross to the grave and instead of us to go like from the grave Let's change that and do it like this. Grave to the sky. Very nice. The idea is still using tritone substitutes uh, for this. So our tritone is going to be this. Da, 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 da. And we're playing basically a diminished chord. This is a chord. And we're voicing it this way. There are so many ways you can approach uh, something like this. But we're just looking at some uh, common ways we can be doing that. All right, uh, the same stuff. You came from heaven to earth. Instead of us to go to this, we're like, nah, okay, let's try and see if we can substitute this for that. For a minor nine or our 
show you how we can do it. So you came from heaven to earth. Let's play a pass in there. Okay. So we are playing the A7 chord. This is the A7, and we're just bringing the D flat here. So this pass to this minor. From the cross to the grave. Very nice. Let's try and do some passing here. From the grave to the sky. Like, oh, okay, what is that? We can just use the diminished passings. Diminished passings are very nice. I like diminished passings a lot. Because I can use them to approach my minor chords. Mm, not only minor chords, but mostly. singer is repeating that phrase Lord I live to name on night we normally call it like a turnaround you, you're doing a turnaround Lord I live to name on night repeating that phrase repeating that phrase let's see uh, how we can approach that we would normally be like two five one then we'll probably go to a six then two five I know this, uh, I want something different. All right, um, let's see what we can do normally. Lord, I live to name one night. You can go to your six, right? All right, we are going to change uh, this and do it like this. Okay, you be like, oh, that, please, that is not beginners. Oh, it is. Let's just look at it from probably deep perspective so if we're looking at it from deep perspective we're just playing a D7 sauce 2 chord so this is your D7 right we're not playing the 3 so the 2 we add is going to give us our sauce 2 chord D7 sauce 2 and we are playing a sharp 11 of using this sharp 11 as a tritone substitute great so we play it here 
we play this here great and we play this in our right hand ah, a very nice chord oh. have to go to your six everybody's just knowing that I'm going to my six you can just do this a very nice um, idea there uh, there are so many options that you can use let's see another one mm, probably we can just play this a minus seven flat five chord to be like, ah, oh, what is that chord? I'm just playing this. Right. This is our D minor, then minus seven, and we are playing it flat five, great. So this is how we get the chord. And we're voicing it this way, on the left hand, then this on the right hand. Very nice. This is another way of doing that. Uh, I can show you a lot of ways you can be doing your turnarounds. Probably in other lessons we'll be looking at them as beginners. Um, in order not to make this uh, very long, let's just end here. And next time we learn something again, very interesting. We build on ourselves as beginners, and we will reach there. We will get to that point where we can also play those. Uh, crazy chords right mm. have fun with music and enjoy practice right bye